I'm Sean, I work for Commuter Services Parking Enforcement at the University of Utah. My name is Ben, I work for Commuter Services Parking Enforcement. Hi, my name is Michael Dobbins, I'm officer number 42. I am an officer with Parking Enforcement for the University of Utah. I enjoy my job a lot, it gives me an opportunity to get out and ride the bike in the sun. It's a great job, I, I get paid to be outside on a bike and work out. My name is Belcher, I'm a supervisor in Parking Enforcement. We enforce the parking regulations dictated by the state. Expired meters, no permits, stolen permits, exorbitant unpaid tickets or fines. The general procedure for writing, say, a meter ticket is uh, first we have to see if it's expired. If it's expired, we check for permits because there's some permits that could park at expired meters. Then we have the process of typing in the license plate. And after that, we have to fill out the lot number, the row number, and what the violation is for and print out the ticket. We take pictures of every car that we ticket, so if you do get a ticket and you want to contest it, then you got to make sure you have some pretty good evidence. After you have three tickets, after a certain amount and period of time, you can get a boot put on your car requiring you to pay those tickets by a certain time that evening, or you can have your car towed right off of campus. My name is Alma Allred. I'm the Director of Commuter Services. Most of our uh, officers are students. They have to be pretty versatile. They, they ride bikes. It's kind of physically demanding, but it keeps them in shape. We also oversee the, the parking for special events, football games, basketball games. Uh, it's a pretty big job here. Here in the locker room, bike room, is where these guys change and store the bicycles. Each guy is assigned a bike and a spot on which to store it. They have to clean them every day, they have to report any maintenance that's required. They're sized to the person by height and weight, and uh, that's the bike you'll have until you leave. Working for the Department of Commuter Services, we're pretty much in charge of parking and even parking during events. All these golf carts here are for mostly events, also pay lots, I guess. We keep our boot vehicles here, especially um, the Durango just mostly because it is pretty expensive and we don't want anyone messing with it. This vehicle I'm in is called an LPR. It's a license plate recognition vehicle. What this thing does is up to 40, maybe 50, maybe even 60 miles an hour. It will read license plates and that information back to the database here and allows us to tell if we need to uh, cite it, give it a ticket. The two in the front We'll get the cars coming and those in the back catch it while it's going, moving or otherwise. They work uh, at night during bad weather or what have you. The uh, possibility of you not getting a ticket if this car drives through your parking lot is highly unlikely. <laughs> it gets a little difficult sometimes. We're not the most popular people on campus. People don't like us very much. You have to deal with a lot of angry people. I mean, obviously. Uh, what we do isn't exactly uh, loved by everyone, but it's just kind of part of the job. No job comes without its downsides. I know, you know, people don't like us. We, we understand that and uh, we get it. I think they're just trying to do a job just like anybody else. Uh, somebody has to enforce the parking. If there were no enforcement, uh, no one could find a place to park. It would be, it would be pandemonium on campus. I don't like giving tickets. I'm sure that the people that get tickets don't like it. I don't like it. I think over the years, a lot of people thought of them as police officers. We try to think of them more as uh, customer service people who try to make sure that everybody who paid to park gets a fair shake. One thing that you should know, that uh, we're not commission-based or whatever, we're, we don't have a quota. We don't waste time waiting for your meters to expire, that kind of thing. While people are, uh, you know, they have a certain opinion, um, I'm sure that when certain times they're really happy to see us we give free jumps that would cost you 20 bucks if you call someone if they come to do it i mean all in all like parking enforcement is just a job for me um, i enjoy doing it but it's not like my life it's not like i love giving out tickets or anything like that i mean i'm a student too i don't try to like make it hard on other students i always try and cut people a break as much as i can